to anti-war protests coming together at UW-Milwaukee. Students camping out on campus supporting Palestinians during the Israel-Hamas war. Today, a group of high schoolers staging a walkout in Shorewood. The group of about 100 students marching to the UWM encampment to show their support. And tonight, students from Marquette making their way down to Oakland and Kenwood. 12 News Emily Paulfall is live at the UWM encampment tonight. Yeah, they joined the encampment here on UW Milwaukee's campus. People have been staying in these tents for four days now for these students. They're coming together to stand for a common cause. Marquette University students protesting the Israel Hamas war Thursday started near the Milwaukee Central Library. We will not stop, we will not rest. And marched through Marquette's campus. What we're asking is solely to have our people live free and um, not under occupation and live with the rights that we are all privileged to have. And so in our point of view, it's very exhausting to continuously ask people to agree with this. They're asking Marquette University to stop working with any company that has ties to Israel and for the school to publicly call for a ceasefire. Marquette responded in a statement saying, quote, the university will continue to work with students from all backgrounds and faith traditions to foster dialogue and empathy for what people are feeling and experiencing due to the Israel Hamas war. A car caravan of protesters all the way to UW Milwaukee, waving flags and chanting along the way. The UWM encampment on day four, Thursday full of hundreds of people. Now we have Marquette. Um, it shows uh, where, where the student movement is at. It shows where the students of Milwaukee are at. It shows where the youth of the world are at. Combining their voices to make the calls for peace louder, even as many protesters say they're tired of echoing the same refrain. What I don't understand is how we're still speaking about this. Why we're still speaking about this? And why do I need to come up here and say they deserve to live? Emily, the Marquette students planning on starting an encampment anytime soon, do we know? Marquette organizers tell me that they're not planning on starting their own encampment right now, instead just focusing on supporting UW Milwaukee's here. And we see this happening all across our country. Emily Pofal live for us tonight in Milwaukee. According to the Hamas run Gaza Ministry of Health, more than 34,000 people have been killed in Gaza in the nearly seven month war. The Israeli Ministry of Foreign Affairs reports at least 1,700 people have been killed in Israel.